Good morning, coffee lovers. My name's William, and you're watching Camo Coffee Critic. Today, I'm in Columbia, Tennessee, here at Mule Town Roasters. Columbia, if you don't know, is also known as Mule Town, so let's get inside and check it out. Espresso and comes in a lovely little Mule Town espresso mug. Love that. Nice layer of creme on the top, and let's uh, dig in before the shot dies. Quick sip to get that initial taste. So the aroma actually matches well with the taste, which is what you would expect. So nice, smooth, but you've got that roasty flavor that you want. Um, there's another flavor in there that I can't quite place. And it's got a nutty, fruity note, so all in all, thumbs up for me. Let's move on to uh, Drip Room Coffee and see what we got. is the brewed coffee. Aroma, I'm not, it's a medium roast, so. Nice fragrant aroma, you got the nice roasty, roasty, nutty flavor, so. About what you expect from a medium roast, but it doesn't have that subtle hint that you would expect from a craft coffee, so uh, I'm excited to see how it tastes. Let's dig in. Ooh, that's hot. Try that again. So, again, nice and very nice and smooth. It does not have that bite at all that you'd expect from a black coffee. Nutty, a little bit of a fruity note. So, all in all, thumbs up for me. That, that is excellent. If you're looking for just a good cup of coffee. Let's move on to the Specialty Latte and see if one of their baristas wants to show off their skill and showcase some latte art. Hey, and if you're watching this video and you like what you see, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe down below. There's a bell down there somewhere if you want to get notified when I post more content. certainly not least, the Hardison Mill Latte. It looks and smells really good. It kind of smells like a gingerbread cookie, so getting close to Christmas now. That's, we're not quite at Thanksgiving uh, when I'm shooting this, but uh, let's see where we are on flavor. <clears throat> now that wasn't the flavor, that was me sucking cinnamon into my nose. Let's try that again. Very nice signature latte from Mealtown Roasters. So it tastes like, it kind of reminds me of like snickerdoodle or gingerbread, but perfect. Very few want sweets, but you've also got that, um, you've just got that rich flavor of the espresso that I had earlier, so that's, that's an excellent drink. That's a thumbs up and a 10 out of 10 for me, Mealtown Roasters. Thank you guys so much for having me. Alright, 
final impressions. Mule Town Roasters, thank you guys so much for having me. Everything was excellent. And if you guys are ever in the Columbia, Tennessee area, Mule Town Roasters is definitely a nice local coffee shop to check out. I highly recommend it. Thumbs up and thank you guys again. As always, my name's William and this has been Camo Coffee Critics. See you guys in the next video. Hey guys, I just wanted to add that even if you're not in the mood for coffee, there's plenty of shopping down here. You just gotta look for this big courthouse. Only in Columbia, Tennessee. And also, did you know that, I guess I forgot his name, but the main guy from American Pickers has an Airbnb in one of these buildings. I'm not sure which one, but I know it looks at the courthouse. So it's either over there or it's up here. So. If any of y'all know which building it is, uh, let me know in the comments. But uh, yeah, see you guys in the next video. <laughs>